Hi, my name's Jonathan Hicks. I'm back in the Dice Cup and I'm joined by... Andy. And... Steve again. Uh, there were a couple of other people playing with us as well, but they've wandered off. Uh, this is Codenames Pictures. So you're on two teams and you have this grid of pictures instead of words, which is what the normal code names is. And it, uh, each team has a code giver who looks at this grid and the grid matches the pictures. So you can see if the top left one is red here, that means this one is red. So the red team are trying to get their team to say all the red pictures from here. And the blue team are trying to get them to say the blue ones. And the way you do that is you give a clue. So you might say round three. And then the blue team would look at the pictures and think, well, this is round, so they'll go for that one. And then you have to put the appropriate thing on here to mark if they've got it right or if they've got it wrong. And you can carry on trying to guess uh, until you get it wrong or until you run out of clues. So in this case, if you said three, you can actually guess one more so you could try and guess four of them. And then the other team guesses, and it's just a race to see if you can get all of your clues before the other team gets theirs. Opinions? I like this game. It's uh, I like uh, the original code names is also good. Um, I like the the pictures in this. I think are quite cleverly devised. Yeah, they uh, have a lot of double meanings. Surreal, they? And there's many meanings within most of them. Yeah. Um, it's find it's finding those meanings in them, finding a single word that will link many pictures together. It's diff it's hard. It's I don't know if it's as hard or is, if it's easier than the original code names. Um, it's different. And you can also mix it with code names as well, which is also good. Okay, Steve. Uh, we actually tried this with Dixit cards um, about a year ago, I think, and we tried putting 25 Dixit cards playing regular code names with it. And these pictures are better because there's generally just two major things in each picture. You've got a birthday cake with dynamite. That's two major things. Dixit cards are random. Um, so to some extent, I like this, but I actually don't like it as much as the original code names. I actually can't put my finger on why. Okay. Um, I love it. I'm a big fan of Codenames. I think it's a superb game. I think this is as good as Codenames. As Andy said, really, it's different. I don't think it's better. I don't think it's worse. Uh, in terms of ratings, I'd probably put this on a 9. I've had tremendous success with gamers and non-gamers alike. Played this a lot with my family, and they really enjoy it. So in terms of ease of use for a game that I can play with almost anybody, it's just superb. Rating, Andy? Uh, I'll give this an 8 and a 5. Eight and a, an 8 and a 5. <laughs> an 8 and a half. Okay. <laughs> uh, see. Uh, I'd probably give it a 7, and not because I don't like it, and I would gladly play it every time it's out, because if I had the choice, I'd rather play Codenames, the original. All right. Thanks very much for watching. That was... Codenames Pictures.